Hello everyone, my name is Derek Vanover. Today I'll be taking you through the steps to open the Balaboka application and to open an ebook for reading. First, you should open the Balaboka on your device of choice and it should appear as in the screen as shown. Click File in the top right corner of the program. Click Open to open the file and locate the file that you would like to read, either a file or an ebook. Once you have located and opened the document onto the screen, you'll select the green button under the voice option in the top toolbar. This will open up the application to start reading the document. Final exam study guide. On this exam, all as it begins to read, you will see that all of the letters after being read will appear blue. Once you begin to read the program, it will continue to go all the way through the steps. If you encounter an error while it is reading, if it is going too fast or too slow, simply hit up underneath the options the blue button with the two lines to pause it. Go under the options tab you can check your settings or you can best way to do it is look at your voice option click the voice button from the top click the right and you can either increase or decrease the rate of speed to which the person is reading your ebook or attachment. You can also look at the pitch under voice. You can either raise or lower the pitch of the automated person that is reading the document and or ebook. Once you have completed this and you have it to your settings, after you get done with your document, you can either keep it the same or you can reset all of those and go beyond. There is another option here under the tool options for voice. So here we have David desktop and then we have another option under here. So there are voice options that you can select to make the document whatever voice you would like to hear. Once you have done all of this, then you want to go back to the very beginning go to the speech button on the top. Here you will have options to where you can skip to the previous sentence, skip to the next sentence, skip to the previous paragraph, or skip to the next paragraph. As you can see, we're already done with this paragraph, so the best option for us would be skip to the previous paragraph, to which it will take you all the way back to the beginning. And then it will start reading based off of your options that you have selected for your voice and speed options. Once you have completed this and got it back to the beginning, you can press the green button to continue reading, and it will go back through. Once your document has completed reading the ebook and or document that you have chosen for it to read for you, you can then go to the file option and you can do one or two things. You can either close this application to open up a new one or you can go to file and exit or there is a third option that is available within the software if you need to discuss or talk with someone about anything you can actually use this to type as well
Once you are completed typing whatever you need to type, press the green button to read aloud, and it will go through, and the speech will appear for whatever you need to have the document for. Once it has completed, then if you are completed for the day, you can either close the application. If you want to save any changes, you can. If you would like to use that same information for a later document, or you can go to File, and you can exit. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video about Balaboka. My name is Derek Vanover, and I appreciate your time. Thank you.